And what about this guy? We always talk about this guy because he has one eye and needs to go to the optometrist. But what about this guy? He didn't read the map wrong. He just read the map. <laughs> All right, guys, today we are in Columbia, Missouri at a Spirit Halloween that used to be a natural grocer. I don't even know if I've ever heard of a natural grocery before, but if there's anything to eat in here, I'm sure the zombie babies have already taken care of it. I will tell you what, though, something smells good, and there's a Chipotle right over there. Anyways, let's go on into this Spirit Halloween and see what we can find of spookiness for 2022. Thank you, Automatic Doors. Oh, I'm liking the look of this place. We've got some animatronics here. We've got a setup over here, and I'm not sure how big this store is, but let's just take a walk around and find out before we do anything else. Whoa, look at this, guys. I just saw this on Spirit's website this morning. Michael Myers Halloween mug. And it looks like they have some of our favorite spirits slash ghost face shirts here. One, two, three, four of them to be exact. And with that in mind, let's traverse to the corner back here. Oh my gosh, I'm still looking for those blue and purple masks. But looking at what they do have, they have the ghost face light up masks, they have the slayer kit, they have the regular ghost face mask, the viper face, the ghost mace, the ghost mace, the ghost face hats. They have the red devil face dead by daylight masks. They have a couple of costumes. And look at this, guys, they actually even have the ghost face jerseys. And what in the world is this right behind me? A Chucky Child's Play shirt that I have not seen before. What the heck? It's like a Hawaiian shirt, but it says good guys, and it has all stuff that Chucky would play with if he were an actual boy. I'm a real boy! It looks like this store comes back here and goes around. And I have to stop and say hello to my zombie baby friends. Hello, 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 hello. All right, let's keep moving here for a minute. Okay, look at this creepy crimson girl on a swing. I didn't realize, but I've recently been told that the creepy crimson girl is not actually an animatronic. I always thought she had a built-in swinging mechanism, but apparently you had to buy it separately. Anyways, they have lots of side steppers here. And a Sam, two Sam sitting dolls. Lots of Chucky dolls, a couple of Tiffany's, Chucky greeters, a Sam greeter, a Sam and ghost face inflatable. Okay, when the music comes on, it's gonna be loud again back in that corner. So let's make our way up here and see what, inf uh, what animatronics, I almost call them inflatables, animatronics they have on the floor for sale. And look at this, guys. We have a possessed pumpkin. We have three young Crouchies. How cool is that? We have two super hot nozzles with a jalapeno nose. And then over here we have some stuffed dummy props. And we have two Lord Farquads. They have a Mr. Dark here, but he's looks to be getting set up because you can see his mechanism back here. So we're not going to mess with him. But there are more animatronics back here for sale. We have two Bubba's Man's Possessed Friend. We have several Pose and Stay Skeletons. Sinister Spirit Dolls. We have a Monty over here. We have a Reagan, a Lil Scally Bones, another Reagan, and another Young Crouchy. I just love seeing the whole display with all the boxes sitting here. Especially when you have stores that have tons of them and they're like stacked on top of each other. All right, I hear Young Crouchy in here, so let's go see what he's up to. Hello, Mr. Haircut. He is set up on the sensor, and then we have Barry over here who also is on the sensor, and he's banging his head. We have all four bubbles of death tubes working. I just heard the sounds of death coming from there, and we have the monitor of death up there. Let's not forget about the chains of death and the grim of death. Come on, Grim. Are you going to work, Grim? So do you. 
Ooh, we have three of the plush Sam with the alternate head. Lots of spooky doggo costumes. We have the Sam by the lamp post that everybody's looking for, or at least they were looking for. We have the snow globe from Killer Clowns. We have, oh, try any button on back of base. Well, I pushed the button and then that light came on, but he's not doing anything more than that. So I don't know if he's supposed to do anything more than that. And I like how they have this framed picture of Michael Myers, just like you hang it on your wall like he's part of the family. Stickers for the bucket. I'm always on the lookout for things I haven't seen in other stores, and this stuff is pretty much what we've seen in all the other stores so far. The Hanging Phantom Ghost, Pumpkin Light, Vampire and Devil Door Knockers, Jack-O-Lantern and Burning Skull Pathway Markers, Decaying Zombie Groundbreakers, Cracked Skull Zombie Groundbreaker, couple of different creepy lantern pathway markers, and of course we have the zombie arm pathway markers. Ghost inflatable, reaper inflatable, jack-o'-lantern inflatable, haunted tree inflatable, reaper inflatable, we already said that one. Gargoyle inflatable, let's see, tombstone, and then of course we have the jack-o'-lantern archway down here and the scary clown archway. And I love these dropping spiders. You hang it from the ceiling and then somebody comes by and it drops down and scares the living crap out of them. Here's a body bag. Now I saw one of these the other day and it was inflatable. Is this inflatable? Looks like it. You blow it up and then you wrap the tape around it in some black trash bags. I love when this aisle of ghouls is so packed that when you walk through it's almost like you're walking through a haunted house. We only have one creeping cat in the store. Chains of death, hanging body parts, hanging Sams, hanging ghost faces, hanging clowns. Ooh, we got some good plush here too. Look, we have Crouchy. We have two Crouchies and two Skellibones. Make that three Skellibones. We got the Vamp Teddy. We have Lydia. We have Beetlejuice. We've got the Lydia side steppers down here. And we have, oh, some of these statues. Are they gonna do something here? Come on, please. Oh, there he goes. He lights up. Beetlejuice snake. Oh my gosh, look what someone did. They hung a rat-eating zombie baby right here on the rack. That is pretty creepy to look down here and see. Oh, well, you know, I just like to hang around. Let's look at some of these costumes back here. Oh, look at this. Whenever I'm hungry, all I see in the costumes is the food. Look at this. We got milk and cookie, a taco. We got a cheeseburger up here peanut butter and jelly, a delicious hot dog. And then in the middle of all that deliciousness, we have a banana. <laughs> okay, so let's look at a couple of these other ones here. We have the inflatable wavy arms guy, the pickle, the inflatable chicken, the inflatable alien pick me up. It looks like the alien picks you up and is running away with you. The inflatable balloon animal, the inflatable cow, the inflatable ostrich, the breathalyzer, inflatable sumo wrestler, and of course, the party pooper. Oh look, we also have an inflatable baby. And let's not forget about grandma. Look, we have a squirrel and a deluxe gorilla, inflatable bull rider, teddy bear piggyback. It looks like you're riding the teddy bear. Oh my gosh, look at this, sergeant short pants. <laughs> We've got Wizard of Oz costumes, the Wicked Witch, the Scarecrow, Glinda, Dorothy, and this furry fellow. I love these Crayola costumes simply because of the elf looking hat. Oh, we have the Powerpuff Girls, Blossom, Bubbles, and Buttercup, but no Mojo Jojo. Here's the trick or treat knife. I think we just saw this in one of the other stores. You don't see this too often. They have a whole bunch of Holly Ho chocolate bars out this season. We got the lollipop that goes with Sam and the light up lollipop. That's cool. Oh, and look at this, guys. Have we seen this in any other stores? The Crouchy Knife? Man, you could just collect all these different knives. I know there's the one from Sam, which I just showed you. Now there's the Crouchy. There's also one from Ghostface. And I think there's a Michael Myers one, too. Let's look over here and see if they have that. No, they don't have it here, but I have seen it. These are just, oops, just regular replica knives. 
but I know they do have the one that has Michael Myers on it. Just have to keep an eye out in other stores for that one. I do not recall seeing one for Friday the 13th because he never really uses a knife. He uses the machete. I don't recall seeing one for Chucky either. This is like the closest thing you're going to get to that. Of course, they do have the axe and the hammer and a couple of different knives like this. This is the voodoo knife, and then they have these down here. I definitely don't recall seeing one for Freddy because he just uses his blades. And yeah, they don't have it here, but I have seen the ghost face one. Oh my gosh, guys, look at this. I have not seen these in any other stores. People are posting them all over the internet, and this is the very first time I've ever seen them. The Killer Clowns from Outer Space hand puppets. Look at those. That is too hilarious. Those are $21.99, and they are so cool that I'm gonna make a short about them right now. So if you've seen that short, you know exactly which store they came from. And look at this, guys, they also have the Killer Clown's door cover, which I don't think I've seen in any other stores either. Oh, I don't think we've looked at the creepy dolls yet. Okay, guys, so they have Rosalie, they have Eerie Emma, they have the creepy baby doll, the decrepit haunted doll, they have a pumpkin nester, and they have a hugs. Now, in all these stores recently, I've just been showing you what they have, but it's quiet enough in here, I think we can listen to them. Or at least it was till that song came on. Yeah, I'm sorry guys, the loud music always makes it difficult to film stuff like that. Here's some more ghost face things over here in the kids section, and I don't think I've seen this before, I have seen it online. It's the ghost face trick or treat hand. That is pretty awesome. Here's the Crouchy costume. I've seen a lot of little fellows buying that one. And here's Hugs. You gotta love Hugs, man. And what about this guy? We always talk about this guy because he has one eye and needs to go to the optometrist. But what about this guy? He didn't read the map wrong. He just read the map. Oh, they have the Spirit animatronic bag clips if you guys are looking for them. They have Nightmare Before Christmas. Yeah, these are the ones that are, oh, they're all mixed up in here. <laughs> okay, these are the kinds that I bought that I haven't opened yet. They are like a hard rubber like these, if you've opened up any of these yet. And then there's another kind like this for Nightmare Before Christmas that are plush. And I am totally striking out today because what I was hoping for was the Hocus Pocus ones in here and they don't have them, but they do have these. I would like to get these because they have gremlins and they have goonies. These are really cool, but I don't wanna buy just like a couple of them. I wanna buy the entire case. All right, before we go, let's go ahead and leave young Crouchy some stickers here. And let's leave a couple for Sam and Michael. Let's leave one for Sam, and let's leave one for Frankie. And we'll leave the rest for our favorite zombie babies.